first in the morning, KC Sunrise, Central Valley's news station. A dangerous pest is threatening citrus trees in California. The Asian citrus psyllid can carry a disease that destroys the fruit and kills the tree. So join us this morning to tell us what we can do to protect our trees is Ted Batkin, president of the California Citrus Research Board. This sounds kind of scary, and we were talking a little bit earlier about the moth that is destroying the grape crops. Right. Is this similar? Well, it's uh, it's similar. It, they're, they have the same level of impact. The Asian citrus psyllid is, uh, carries a bacteria that is a disease that can kill the citrus tree. Once it gets the bacteria, the tree is toast. So where is it coming from? What does it look like and what does it do? Well, the pest is invading into California from Mexico, which is the typical pathway where most of our pests come from. And it's into San Diego and into Los Angeles area. And we're trying to prevent it from getting into the San Joaquin Valley. Now, there are other regions of the country, of actually the world, that have experienced problems from this and have devastated the crops. Yes, it has. It's uh, cut back dramatically the uh, citrus crops in Brazil, and now Florida is uh, losing their trees uh, at the rate of about 20% per year. And we're looking at this orange right now, and we see something right in the center there. What is that? Well, that's a, a seed that's aborted. That's the uh, results of what the disease causes in the fruit. And the, uh, the leaves that you see there are uh, some spotting, and the fr fruit turns kind of green at the end. So it's called greening mm. is the disease that uh, we're concerned with. Okay, well, right now what we see are these beautiful blossoms, the orchards, and even the backyard orchards smell so good. Is there anything that we should be looking for right now that is suspect? Well, as the uh, trees uh, put out new flush, uh, that's where they lay the eggs. And then the adults look like little tiny thorns. This is about the size of an aphid that you might find on your rose bush. So we, uh, uh, we look for these little tiny pests, and they look like a thorn. And if people see these, we ask them to contact the uh, ag commissioners in their county. Okay, so you're looking for a little thorn, and about what time of the year is that going to start showing up? We'll probably start seeing it if it shows up here into the San Joaquin Valley as early as uh, July or August, and then the season runs pretty well through the spring, uh, into the summer, and into the fall. And that's a shot of our lovely little psyllid right there. There it is. That's a little tiny critter, but it carries a huge wallop. All right. So once again, if you see this on your backyard orange tree, it's a serious problem because right. it could affect the farmers with their giant orchards. And then we see a problem with the, the oranges here in the valley, right? Well, it's a major impact, economic impact to the San Joaquin Valley. And it's also a uh, potential loss of trees for all of the homeowners. And so we're asking uh, everybody to kind of help us and cooperate because we're all in this together. Okay, very good information. Thank you so much, Ted, for coming in and telling us about it. If you have questions about the citrus psyllid, we'll give you information on our website at kc24.com. All you have to do is click on Sunrise, and it'll be linked up there for you. You can also contact the Ag Commissioner's Office if you have any questions.